Wow. Oh, look who's behind me. Oh, man, that sounds fantastic. Like that, huh? Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Well, you know, we got to get going on those rockin' parfaits. Turn that music yeah. up. With pleasure. So today's show features an exciting twist on a ho-hum cruciferous vegetable. Cauliflower cutlets. Easy and colorful salad. Easy salad. A quick green side dish and a mouth-watering berry dessert. Dessert. All prepared with just picked farm fresh ingredients. Plus, a musical surprise on the side. Singing Mr. Ricky Midlife. Rock and roll. tuned for my garden fresh meal right here on Jazzy Vegetarian. Jazzy, you're gonna be healthy with the Jazzy Vegetarian. Jazzy, so snazzy. We're gonna cook something healthy and light. Should it do you do that? Should it do you do that? Jazzy, so snazzy. So join me in the kitchen right now. We're gonna cook something healthy and light. That's right. Why am I playing the air guitar? This is a food show. We have some surprises in store for you today. But first, we're going to talk about the food, because turning freshly picked fruits and veggies into a wow meal is on my agenda today. Now, to start, roasted cauliflower cutlets with lemon caper sauce make sophisticated use of cauliflower. And on the side, zingy roasted asparagus preps in a flash, and grape tomato avocado and fresh herb salad makes great use of summer tomatoes. Now, berry parfaits with cashew coconut cream highlights juicy berries layered with a rich dairy-free cream. Yeah, it's all happening on today's show, so stay with me. Berry parfaits with cashew coconut cream. I've gotten a lot of emails from you saying, I want a cream without any soy in it. And this season, we're really addressing that. And we're doing this soy-free, dairy-free, and this whole meal is gluten-free today as well, with all fresh ingredients. We have our special guest here. I told you we were gonna have some fantastic musical happenings on today's show. And right now, we got Ricky Medlock in the house. Well, Ricky Medlock is the lead guitarist with the fabulous rock group, Leonard Skinner. Yep. But what many of you may not know about Ricky is that you're a fantastic record producer. Oh, I don't know about that. Right now, I've got a young band in that's recreating the name Blackfoot, and it's for a whole new generation, so we're about two-thirds of the way through a brand new record. That's how Ricky and I met. He was a producer on a record that I was doing, and we made some beautiful music together. Yes, we did. So now we're going to make some beautiful food together. That looks delicious already. You spend 150 days a year or more, you're rocking and rolling <laughs> on the road. At least. And you still make sure that you eat healthy. When you are on the road, it is very difficult. You do a show. You get off stage, you go back to the hotel, you get your bags together, shower up, you get on the bus. By the time you get on the bus, your body says, I need nourishment. Of course, after show food is pizzas and all kinds of stuff. Instead of reaching over and grabbing a pizza, reach over and grab an orange or an apple. Got to get to our cream topping that isn't get cream. Get to it. Yeah, I want to cool, see this. Right? So what we're starting off with is one and a half cups of raw cashews, one and a half cups of spring water. You put them in your refrigerator, soaking in that water for about one to two hours. Also, raw, unsweetened, shredded, dried coconut. We've soaked it for about one to one and a half hours in some water, and it's gotten nice and soft. Drain the water out of it. But when you're done soaking the cashews, drain them, rinse them, and rinse them again. We're just going to add our raw cashews that we've soaked. Then we're going to add a quarter cup of coconut, a little bit of vanilla extract. That's mm -hmm. one teaspoon of that. And you know how I love maple syrup. You know I love <laughs> maple syrup. And what I'm adding here is two tablespoons of maple syrup, three quarters of a cup of spring water. This is really interesting. I'm glad you like it. Just going to get started on low. That's rock and roll. Yeah, that's right. 